There are many types of roof coverings. The most common types are asphalt and fiberglass shingles, wood shingles and shakes, tile and slate, metal roofs, and bituminous membranes. Let's look at the key installation issues for each type and considerations for selecting materials most suited for your application. Fiberglass and asphalt shingles are the most common. Because their effectiveness depends on water running past each shingle quickly, they should not be applied to a roof with a slope less than 312. Whether you choose asphalt or fiberglass shingles, you should compare life cycle costs when making the roof material decision. We recommend you always select the longest lasting shingle possible. Like all roof materials, fiberglass and asphalt shingles need to be carefully integrated with the underlayment and flashing systems. Wood shingles and shakes are typically made from red or white cedar because these varieties of wood have a greater resistance to decay and also have low shrinkage. Decades ago, contractors would always further wood shakes up off the roof. Unfortunately, today we often see the wood shakes nailed directly onto the underlayment. We know that some water will pass through the shakes. If a wood shake is allowed to stay wet, the shake will get musty and a fungi or mold will grow within its substrate. This fungal decay can break down the shakes and significantly shorten their life. There are techniques and products in the market that allow us to create an airspace between the wood shake and the underlayment. This allows the shake to dry more effectively after rain or snow melt and last twice as long. Tile and slate are products that can last a long time. A critical consideration for these roofing materials is a properly designed and installed underlayment and flashing system. As with all roofing materials, wind-driven rain and snow melt will pass through them. In addition, because clay and concrete tile absorb and hold water, an airspace between the tile and the underlayment is critical. This airspace helps protect the entire roof system from moisture and mold-related problems. Common reasons for choosing a metal roof is for long life, aesthetics, and low maintenance. In cold climates, it is important to manage the snow that can accumulate on a metal roof and keep it from sliding off and causing damage or injury. We recommend that there are ice breaks and snow breaks along the roof edge. Local building codes may also require that lightning rods be installed for metal roofs. Remember to consult the manufacturer when selecting a roof covering for your climate. We recommend that long-lasting roof materials always be used. This way your homeowners will not have to bear the expense of an early roof replacement and our landfills will not be burdened with this waste. If you're participating in a green building program, you may be required to use the most durable and longest lasting product available. Consideration may also be given to using a product manufactured from recycled materials.